Are you potty? You come here and tell Jarvis that you let that lovely, juicy specimen escape, and you think an apology's gonna cut it? Ooh, this jars. Do you crackpots think sorcerers like Veronica come along often? Do you have any idea what we'll have to do to nab a specimen like that again? You knew I wanted to drain all her magic so I could earn the Lord of Shadow's respect when he came back. All my plans shattered. The Lord of Shadows? That's them. They're the monsters who jumped me in the bathhouse and brought me here. See that jar by the big fat one? That's what he was sucking all my magic powers into. Then I guess we'd better figure out how to get them back. Hmm. But Veronica. Huh? Uh. Oh, Splashy. I do love guests. <laughs> Especially when they bring me presents. If it isn't the one that got away, talk about it in the jackpot. Now, just sit tight while we suck every ounce of magic out of you. Boys, this lot have earned a VIP treatment. Get cracking! Uh, looks like we'll be fighting our way out of this one whether we like it or not. <laughs> Thank you. 
I'll never be the Lord of Shadow's right hand man if I can't even beat the likes of you lot. Ugh. All my dreams shattered. Who is this Lord of Shadows you keep mentioning anyway? <laughs> You'll find out soon enough when everything finally goes to pot. <sighs> We'll find out soon enough, huh? <laughs> right. Time to get my magic back. to worry on that front. I can feel the old magic zinging from the ends of my pigtails right down to the tips of my toes. But then why do you still look like a little girl? Oh. I'm not really sure. I suppose whatever made me younger can't be fixed just by getting my powers back. But it could be worse. I mean, you know what they say. You're only young. Twice. Trust you to see the funny side. Well, I suppose I'd better get used to having a twin sister half my size. By the way, you have noticed who we're traveling with, haven't you? Of course I have. And so have you, it seems. Yggdrasil's chosen. Long have we waited to greet you. We of Arborea swear to protect you. While we live, none shall defeat you. There are those who would accuse you of bringing disaster on our world. Please, you must rest assured that they are wrong. You are a hero. The light in your eyes, the light told of in the legends of Arborea, it proves that beyond a doubt. <laughs> I knew it was you the moment I saw you. So now you have magical twins swearing to serve and protect you? I guess you really are the luminary, huh? Not that I ever doubted it, of course. There's plenty more we need to talk about, but we have to take care of something first. I wasn't the only one they were keeping prisoner, you know. Now, if I remember rightly, there should be a door around here 